Hello all, welcome back to my YouTube channel all about VLSI. Hope you're all doing good. Uh, I think my voice is audible and my screen is also visible. Can anyone confirm me in the chat? Yeah, I think uh, my voice is audible and my screen is also visible. So let us start today's session. Today the topic is about uh, constraints. We will see. Wait a minute, let me check whether my voice is audible or not. Yeah, my voice is audible. So today's topic is uh, coding constraints. So we'll try to understand the constraints with uh, by taking some examples. Okay. Uh, the theory regarding the constraints already we have discussed in our previous sessions. Uh, if you haven't watched them, please uh, go back and rewatch those sessions so that you can understand this uh, particular lecture easily. Okay. So let me open my software. Quest as well. Now. So I think my screen is also visible. Let me zoom in further more. So that it can be more visible yeah so first let us uh, create a class called uh, constraint underscore examples and in this uh, we should create a variable with rand keyword so if a variable is not uh, declared with the rand keyword it will not be randomized this we have already discussed in our theory sessions also so i will create a variable of a bit data type 7 down to 0 uh, minimum underscore value and let me create one more uh, variable called medium underscore value and another variable called maximum underscore value so these are uh, three variables which I have uh, declared so one is uh, minimum underscore value and another is uh, medium underscore value followed by maximum underscore value so these three variables are of uh, bit data type and declared as RAN keyword of 8 bits okay so these are of bit 7 down to 0 which means 8 bits now so let us write a constraint so for writing a constraint we should use a keyword constraint followed by the name and taking name as range underscore expression followed by curly braces okay constraint should be written inside a curly braces 0 less than minimum underscore value okay semicolon and uh, medium underscore value greater than value semicolon and uh, written some constraint constraint what is meant by what is meant by constraint everything we have discussed constraint is nothing but we are uh, defining some uh, we are defining some conditions like that okay instead of randomizing it uh, blindly we are giving some uh, we are giving some conditions okay so the value should be generated by abiding these conditions okay now what condition we have given in this particular constraint we have given that minimum value yeah sure sure uh, that wedlock series will be continued new wedlock series are uh, will be started so you can follow that okay from the starting uh, the wedlock series will be started okay you can follow that okay now now here what we are doing we are giving a constraint uh, the constraint says that the minimum value should be <coughs> greater than zero and the medium value will should be greater than uh, minimum underscore value and the maximum value should be less than 120 this is what we are declaring using our constraint okay now let us uh, in this class okay now within a module eb underscore constraint uh, let us uh, create handle for our class cons underscore ex like this we have declared and within an initial block initial begin cons underscore ex is equal to new we have created our uh, cons underscore ex dot randomize keyword for randomizing the variables okay now dollar display the value value min underscore val is percentage d basically i'm uh, printing this uh, random values medium underscore value is percentage percentage zero d we'll print this 
and uh, followed by four values percentage zero yes okay comma then directly we cannot access them we should use the object handle the variable should be uh, accessed using the object handle cons underscore ex dot min underscore val okay we cannot access them directly we should use the object handle cons underscore ex dot min underscore val comma cons underscore ex do comma cons underscore ex dot max underscore value okay so this is how i am going to access my variables okay so this is how i am going to access my uh, variables which are declared in my class okay now so i will end this uh, initial in the module okay now let me compile this Yeah, compilation is successful and now let me simulate this particular module start simulation work pb underscore constraint is my module name simulation is in process we should wait for a couple of uh, we will run this let me zoom in this greater than 0 so it is true and medium underscore and medium underscore value is 201 the medium underscore value what we are getting we have given a constraint that medium underscore value should be greater than and max underscore value uh, we are getting what is what is the value random value we are getting we are getting 101 okay uh, what constraint we have given it should be 28 okay so abiding by the rules abiding by the condition what we are what we have given so the given so the particular random numbers has been particular random numbers has been generated okay min underscore value is uh, generated okay min underscore value is uh, greater than zero min underscore value and uh, max underscore value is less than 1.8 at the 1.8 at the output we can see this particular uh, values which output we can see this particular uh, values which which are being generated abiding by the conditions or the constraints what we have given right i hope up to if you are having any doubt or uh, question the chart okay yeah so let us continue now let us take one more scenario uh, so let us take one more scenario here constraint here constraint range underscore expression 2 so let us take one some other